Hi friends, I am Sunil, working as BSNL JE. Welcome to BSNL JE 2016 exam preparation. Okay. In last three previous classes, I explained concepts of instruments and measurements. In this video, I am going to discuss some important bits regarding them. Okay, regarding to the topics. Okay, first one. An ammeter is dash instrument. An ammeter is dash instrument. Ammeter and voltmeter are nothing but indicating instruments. Indicating instruments. In case of energy meter, energy meter is a integrating instruments. Okay, ammeter is a indicating instrument. In moving coil meters, that means moving coil meters, nothing but MC type. Damping is provided by. Damping is provided by in moving coil type nothing but MC type eddy current damping is produced eddy current damping is used eddy current damping is used okay e this eddy current damping is provided by aluminium frame provided by aluminium frame okay the function of swamping resistor put in series with the moving coil of a moving coil meter is dash what is the purpose of swamping resistor i explained okay i explained in previous class what is the purpose of swamping resistor to reduce the temperature variations or to reduce the temperature errors nothing but to reduce the to compensate for transportive variation nothing but temper reduce for temperature 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 variations okay option d moving iron instruments moving iron m that means nothing but mi type moving iron instruments these are used for both ac and dc only dc only ac used for both ac and dc okay option c the following instrument should be used to measure 600 kilo volts ac voltage 600 kilo volts ac voltage I already explained for high voltage purpose which meter is used for high voltage purpose nothing but electrostatic voltmeter electrostatic voltmeters are used for high voltages okay next one instrument used for DC measurement alone DC measurement alone nothing but PMMC type moving iron here the option B PMMC nothing but permanent magnet moving type Next one, which of the following calibrates same on both AC and DC? Both same on both AC and DC. Electrodynamometer type meters are calibrated same on both AC and DC. Okay. An electrical measuring instrument has sensitivity of 100 ohms per volt. On 100 volt scale, the instrument right the instrument wire have internal resistance of internal resistance of nothing but sensitivity we know that sensitivity what are the units of sensitivity sensitivity ohms per volt that means uh, in the form of resistance by volts that is ohms per volt we have to find out resistance that is nothing but r r equal to s into v so S means selectivity and it has given 1000 into V 100 volt scale. So that equal to 10 power 5 ohms. Nothing but C is the answer. Okay. The function of shunt in an ammeter is. The function of shunt in ammeter. The function of shunts it is to increase the. That means to increase the current carrying capacity. How it increase the current carrying capacity. How it increase the current carrying capacity by bypassing the current by bypassing the current through the connected resistance okay the phenomena of creeping occurs the phenomena of creeping what is meant by creeping creeping means slow movement of the disc creeping is nothing but slow movement of the disc without any load that that means uh, in case of uh, how in case of household meters household meters nothing but uh, what uh, nothing energy meters 
uh, in olden days they are uh, they are moving type okay Mo some uh, coil is moving okay without any load without any load or without any consumption also uh, the disc rotates very slowly the disc rotates very slowly due to this creeping effect that means without any load also it uh, moves some uh, with uh, very slow okay because of some uh, storage some energy storage okay this the phenomena of creeping that phenomena of creeping occurs in case of only energy meters energy meters uh, to decrease this keeping creeping we have we can uh, drill uh, we can drill holes to the disc then creeping will reduce us okay swamping resistance is added to the coil circuit swamping resistance it is used to reduce the thermal uh, tem it is used to reduce the temperature error I already explained okay precision measurement of resistance is generally carried out by precision measurement is carried out by bridge method carried by bridge method so option D the most efficient form of damping in an instrument is most efficient damping eddy current damping I already explained to increase the range of voltmeter to increase the range of voltmeter a high resistance is connected in series a high resistance is connected in series I already explained to increase the range of voltmeter high resistance is connected in series to increase the range of uh, ammeter or, or to increase the range of current shunts are used okay sensitivity of a voltmeter is expressed ohms per volt units of sensitivity ohms per volt the most common method for measurement of low resistance kelvin double bridge i already explained each and every bits are from my concepts videos only okay squaring bridge is used to measure capacitance dielectric loss of a capacitor can be measured by squaring bridge dielectric loss of a capacitor measured by squaring bridge Hayes bridge Hayes bridge used for Hayes bridge is used for inductance okay already explained inductance bridges are mainly five Maxwell's Maxwell's induction capacitance Hayes Anderson okay the Hayes bridge is used for inductance Wien bridge is used for it is used for frequency frequency measurement which bridge is used Wien bridge power factor meters it has both current coil and voltage coil okay inductance is measured in terms of capacitance and resistance by using anderson bridge in this anderson bridge the inductance measured in terms of capacitors okay very very important bit holes are drilled in the disk of energy meter on the opposite side of the spindle i already explained in this video only holes are drilled in case of energy meter to reduce the creeping to avoid the creeping okay on no load that means without any load without any consumption deflection of hardware instrument it depend on rms value Defle hardware instruments mainly depend on rms values only rms values only the damping torque can be produced by the damping torque can be produced by it is produced by eddy currents okay produced by eddy currents electrostatic effect for producing deflecting torque is used in electrostatic effect nothing but voltmeters okay voltmeters it is the electrostatic meters are mainly used to measure the high voltages okay so they are used to voltmeters used for voltmeters moving iron instruments are dash type it is both attractive and repulsion types moving iron instruments can be used as both ac and dc the scale of moving iron type is nothing but non-linear non-linear or non-uniform that is nothing but cramped cramped means non-linear or non-uniform most commonly used watt meter is nothing but dynamo meter type okay nothing but dynamo meter type the meter constant of energy meter is 
very very important bit the meter constant of energy meter is given by revolution per kwh kilowatt hour revolution by kilowatt hour okay megger is used measuring for high resistance i already explained megger is used for measuring high resistance multimeter can measure it can measure both current voltage resistance and all so the answer is all electrostatic instruments are suitable for both ac and dc okay in mi meter the deflecting torque is proportional to mi type deflecting torque theta proportional to i square in case of mc type proportional to i answer is a no eddy current and hysteresis loss occur in in dash type of instruments electrostatic type instruments in for these instruments no eddy current no hysteresis loss hardware instruments hardware instruments give the average value the rms value calculated from the average value the rms value based on the heat produced i already explained hardware instruments based on rms value rms value of the heat nothing but the hardware instruments are nothing but thermal type instruments which bridge is used to determine frequency wien bridge manganese is dash material it is a constant temperature coefficient material uh, coefficient of resistant material nothing but standard resistance okay okay thank you friends and also practice number of bits to crack the exam okay thank you